So at the 440-yard 13th, Roberto continued with the driving honor. And this time he left nothing to chance, pounding out a tremendous tee shot right down the pipe. In the rarefied air and the dry fairways, he outdid himself here, finishing over 380 and yards. And as a result, lose the fluid action that helps bring power and control. Roberto DiVicenzo offers a fine example of good technique, and here you'll see it in slow motion. He's driving off the 17th tee. The whole action is very fluid because of a good break of the left knee on the backswing. This allows for a good pivot or turn. You see the knee pointing down and behind the ball. The right leg is firm, taking the weight shift. Now watch Roberto's right knee and how it flexes forward with a move to the left side. At contact, the leg has released and is free to move through the swing with the rest of the body. Don't lose the power potential your legs give you. Be flexible from the waist down, and you'll hit a ball easier and better. Caballero from Argentina, Roberto Di Vicenzo. Di Vicenzo starts it right at the flag, all the way. 